Dr. Elliott, breast cancer does not run in my family. Should I still get a mammogram screening? Every woman is at risk for breast cancer because she's a woman. And the older she is, the higher her risk. The risk starts to go up around age 50, 55, and continues to go up. It never goes down, no matter how old you are. The best screening tool we have at this time is mammography. We can supplement that with other sorts of tests. We can do ultrasounds, good physical exam, sometimes even MRIs. There's some newer technology coming down the road as well, something called tomosynthesis, which is sort of a specialized mammogram. All of these are going to be ways to find abnormalities so that we can either treat them before they're cancer or if they are cancer, find them at a very early stage. A mammogram is a very short test that involves um, compressing the breast in order to look at the tissue within the breast. Um, it, the actual compression is very quick and is only held for a number of seconds. So although people, you'll hear people complain, it's really very, very short. Um, and it's not painful. It's uncomfortable in some people. Um, it depends on their size and it can be different for a lot of people. It depends on their age. I think the most important thing is to get your mammogram um, after your period is started, if you're still having periods, because it's less painful than if you're premenstrual. And, um, and if you're postmenopausal, then that's not an issue generally. But it's not a difficult test. I'd have 100 mammograms to one colonoscopy. <laughs>